How's it going? Nick from Beer Engineers. And excitingly, um, we've got a beer from Phantom Brewing. So that's the first time a beer from Phantom is reviewed on the channel. This has been this brewery has been raved about. I'm not sure where they are. Um, it might be it might be up north. But they yeah. So if you listen to beer podcasts like I do, sad git that I am. Yeah, uh, apparently this is this brewery has come from nowhere. And it's I'm say taking over the the scene, but very very popular in a short space of time. Probably got good ratings on Untapped for whatever that's worth. And this is let's have a look. So second best friend, seven percent IPA, so decent sort of uh, ABV, brewed with lager malt, oats, wheat. And chit. Don't know what that is. On the hop side, we've got Mosaic, Loop Max, Nectron, and Vista. No idea what Vista is. And it actually tells us what yeast it is A38 juice. And it's got barley, oats, and. Okay, yeah, so barley, oats, wheat, basically. So there's quite a lot of detail on this. Yeah, which is uh, pretty good. Pretty nice can art as well. Let's uh, see what it's like. Okay, so looks like standard New England fare. Looks actually quite thick. Yeah, it looks uh, very porridgey, in fact. Yeah, it's pretty dense. Dense orange. A couple of fingers of fluffy white head. Let's go for the nose. So there's, there's, a, there's a bit of um, sort of fruitiness, is that? There is a sort of a, a funky, funky dankness going on there. Yeah, like a cheesy, funky dank. Which I quite like actually. And anything else? Some indeterminate, maybe a bit of tropical, it's difficult to, to, to set it out. Just dive in, chin chin. Okay, so you've got that mosaic funkiness it's not overpairing at all oh it's interesting something just came through at the end there so mosaic so a bit of tropical maybe a bit of citrus as well and then at the end it's not very bitter at all it was like a perfume note rose petals cut flavours, that sort of thing. Um, it's, it reminds me of Talus, but it hasn't got an astringent bitterness. It's just... Mm. Sweetness is subtle. Yeah, so then you get that funky dankness and then, like I said, that floral note running through. It's actually pretty delicious. I wonder, what, I wonder what that um, end hoppies vista. I'll have to Google that. Um, oh, it tells us so they're in Reading in Berkshire, down south. It's really good. The body is actually medium, subtle carb, you know, subtle carbonation, very drinkable. Sweetness is absolutely spot on, not sickly at all, pretty quaffable. Yeah, and then I'm getting sort of a citrusy, tropical. There's no, no particular fruit coming out. There's like tangy orange, maybe, tangy grapefruit, maybe, but mixed in with a bit of tropical, but then that funkiness, and then like I say, that 
surprising floral note that comes in at the end. Mm. Rating? I do really like that. I like that enough to give that... Oh yeah, really interesting that end notice. Yeah, um, I'm giving that eight and a half out of ten, you know. Um, so yeah, so... Obviously it's not just hype. They brew good beer. It's the only one I've had from Phantom. I'll be looking at them more. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Cheers.